right, everyone, it is the workout video. Um, I honestly did such a terrible job with um, trying to stay fit and work out when I was pregnant with AJ. The whole time I was like, mm, no, I don't want to get up. I can't. I'm so tired. Everything hurts. I can't walk. Oh, but could you go to Taco Bell and get me three beef chalupas and a Starburst? Strawberry freeze and two orders of chips and salsa. Thank you. Oh And can you also pick up um, a dozen original glaze from Krispy Kreme? Thank you hmm. So this time <laughs> I'm doing a whole lot better um, and it, it actually is helping me feel better so um, I'm gonna show y'all what I've started with so let's go work out. Um, are some squats most of my pain that I'm having is right in this area here so with all this extra weight here and it's all leaning down and this is the area that feels like it's just being crushed and <laughs> everything especially when I was pregnant with AJ it just felt like everything was just gonna fall out um, <laughs> So I'm going to work on some squats to help um, strengthen my muscles here in this Hi. area. Hi, AJ's over there eating his breakfast. Can y'all see? Oh yeah, y'all can see him. <laughs> So I didn't want to move the um <laughs> the baby gate before when I set it up. I got lazy. But um in order to do one of my workouts, I need the steps. So I'm gonna have to move it anyway. So I'm getting ready to go move that now. And I'm just gonna move it up a few steps.
some toe touches. One. Two. Three. Four. Five. Six. <laughs> <laughs> Hey y'all, me and AJ here, we're in the car, getting ready to go walking. Um, that's my new routine that I've been doing, Well, I just started it this week, so well, all of my workout I've started this week. So walking is one of them, so we go and um, meet my mom at the, at the mall, and we walk around the mall. Um, now the mall, our mall here in town is like pretty much dead <laughs> there's like two main stores left in it and then like maybe maybe like three or four like little tiny stores that you probably wouldn't even remember there until you walk by and you're like oh that's still open but um is it bad that I'm about to stop by Burger King and get me a large icy does that defeat the whole purpose of working out What y'all think? Wrong window. Can I get to the Burger King? How can I help you? Um, yes. Can I get um one large cherry icy and two small cherry icies? Can I get you anything else? That'd be all. Okay, you're calling 435 floor down, please. Thank you. You're welcome. Got the icies now. Time to go walk. Is that crazy? I feel like that's crazy. But at the same time. Cause see, I need something cold to drink while I walk. Cause like I said, the mall is like dead. The mall is dead, so it's hot. They don't have air running, so I need something cold to drink. Ice is perfect. I forgot my water. I don't do it every time. So I'm here. Well, we're here at the mall. Got my icy. <laughs> Now my lips gonna be all red. I got a small one for AJ because he loves them too. The last time he had one though was um a long time ago. And I let him try it and he wanted it all to himself. So I got him a small one. So he wouldn't feel left out. He's over here crying because he, he's trying to get mine. Say hi. Say hi. <laughs> you being cute? Are you being cute? I started walking. Oh, I was about to tell a lot. I started walking Wednesday. Yeah. And um, I walked two laps um, with the break in between. And then yesterday I walked three laps so after two laps I took a break and then I walked one more lap I was so proud of myself I actually walked three laps so yeah I like I really like the walking like I, it makes me feel good <laughs> I, I don't leave that long drink some more Stop playing with that straw. Uh oh. Uh oh. Uh 
吧。Oh. Uh-uh, put the straw back. You gonna take a sip? Take a sip. <laughs> they cold? Okay, not sure why you're shaking it. No, it's not hot. It's cold. <laughs> yeah, why are you tearing the cup up? You're so silly. <laughs> AJ did it. AJ, you broke it. Jay, you broke it. Uh uh, put that straw back. Put that straw back. Oh my lord, y'all. Mm -mm. No. <laughs> da -da. Hey, Jay, is it good? Uh uh, stop. You got some on your arm? <laughs> Yo, I can't with this child. <laughs> what you looking at? Silly. All right, drink your ice. Give me one more sip. And go. <laughs> All done. All done. Yay. Or not. Yay. Yay. AJ, do I need to take this from you? Huh? <coughs> hmm? <coughs> then leave the straw in there, okay? <coughs> oh. Oh. All right, y'all, let's go walk. We are back home. It is raining, so I'm about to grab everything, grab AJ and run on in the house. Um, I managed to walk two laps today. Um, I didn't feel like I was going to be able to do three today anyway. So I managed to get three in without a break. I didn't take a break. Um, so I got two laps in and yeah ready to get in here and relax now house is clean dinner is cooked yeah feed aj put him to bed and relax so yeah another thing i do want to mention though um another thing that i'm dealing with with the uh the pregnancy um is my ribs um my ribs have been um sore like they feel bruised or whatnot so i don't know where that's coming from but um yeah it, it doesn't feel very good but yeah so me and aj about to go ahead and run on in the house and relax the rest of the evening aj you ready to go in okay so he gonna act like he don't hear me but all right let's get in here 
right, so the question I have is pretty simple. What are some other workout ideas that you all have um, for pregnancy? Um, as you can see, I was trying to focus on my stretching because uh, my muscles get really, really tight. And then when I'm not feeling well, I'm doing a lot of laying down. And that makes me very stiff because after laying down and sitting down for a long period of time, then I get up and then I really can't move. Um, so, yes, yeah, so I was focused focused on stretching and um, and my squats to get, you know, my pelvic area strong and ready for another birth. Um, I want to talk about two different passages today in the Bible. Um, I want to go to 1 Timothy, um, chapter 4, verse 8. 1 Timothy, chapter 4, verse 8. And it reads, For while bodily training is of some value, godliness is of value in every way, as it holds promise for the present life and also for the life to come. So to connect that to working out, um, yes, we all want to be fit, we want to be healthy, we want to look good, but we want to make sure that we're living a godly life. Um, the godliness is what's going to hold all of the value. So whether you're skinny or overweight, or if you're, you know, the weight or the fitness that you want to be, or not make sure you're living a godly life the other passage i want to talk about is psalm 18 verse 34. so i'm going to flip there real quick psalm 18 verse 34 and it reads he trains my hands for war so that my arms can bend a bow of bronze so to connect this also to working out and for me with pregnancy, he's leading me to give birth to this wonderful baby. And so now I need to prepare and get ready, get ready for battle because <laughs> that's what it's going to feel like. <laughs> but remember, live a godly life. Um, don't let, you know, fitness and weight and all of that be like your overall focus in life. Um, you may reach your goals and sometimes you may not. When I lost my baby weight with AJ, um, it took longer than I expected. And I still didn't quite lose all of the weight. I was like five or six pounds shy of meeting my goal. So even though that's pretty close... But I still didn't get exactly where I wanted to be before I wound up pregnant with this one. But it's okay. It is okay. Because I know that I live a godly life and that holds more value. I will see you all next week on Sunday at 6 p.m. right here. Okay? And we will have our gender reveal YouTube live party um, <laughs> and just to make things clear um, the YouTube live is the actual party so when you all come and um, log on to watch the video you are the party participants okay so gender reveals Sunday August 13th at 6 p.m. right here on YouTube and I will see you all then y'all have a great week and don't forget to subscribe, comment, click that bell. Also, I need everyone to cast your votes on whether you think Baby McCutcheon number two is team boy or team girl. Um, so make sure you do that. And I will see you all next week.